Good day everyone, I am going to report about one of the species in the family Dugongidae which is Dugong Dugon. Dugongidae is a family in the order of Serenia. The family is one surviving species, the Dugong Dugon, one recently extinct species which is Stellar Sea Cow and a number of extinct genera known from fossil records. And here is the taxonomic classification of Dugong Dugon. Kingdom is Animalia, class is Mammalia, order is Serenia, family is Dugongidae, genus is Dugong, scientific name is Dugong Dugon, and common name is Sea Cows. The Dugong is a marine mammal. It is one of four living species of the order Serenia, which also includes three species of manatees. It is the only living representative of the once diverse family Dugongidae. Its closest modern relative, the stellar sea cow, was hunted to extinction in the 18th century. Dugongs mainly feed upon sea grasses. They eat large amounts of sea grass and they leave a trail of bare sand and uprooted grasses behind them. Dugongs are large marine mammals and they can grow up to 3 meters or 9.8 feet in length and they weigh between 250 and 300 kilograms. They have a large body with thick and smooth skin, and they are cream-colored at birth but develop a brownish or gray or dark gray color as they get older. And their underside is slightly paler, and they have a sparse covering of hair over their body. They have paddle-like front flippers which measure between 35 and 45 cm in length, and they have a flock tail which propels them through the water when they move it up and down. Their head is rounded with small eyes and they have a large snout. Their upper lip is well developed and it forms a U-shaped pad that has two ridges with large and stiff bristles. Dugongs, like other mammals, must surface to breath, but they cannot hold their breath for very long. Their nostrils are situated on the top of their snout and they are able to close them when they go underwater. And lastly, dugongs have excellent hearing but not very good eyesight and sometimes adult males and older females have small tusks. Dugongs are found in the seagrass beds and in the shallow tropical waters of East Africa, West, South, and Southeast Asia, Australia, and in the Pacific Islands. Areas around Northern Australia are where most of the world's population of dugong can be located. And they are sometimes solitary but most form loose groups that average 10 to 20 individuals. And during the winter months, some dugongs will migrate to warmer waters. Dugongs are widely distributed in the Indo-Pacific region in coastal tropical and subtropical waters. They also occur in inshore waters, in bays and channels. The range is discontinuous from Southeast Africa north to the Red Sea, in the Persian Gulf along western India to Sri Lanka, and throughout Indonesia in the Pacific Islands to the Rocky Islands in the north and the central coast of Australia in the south. Conservation Status Dugongs are listed as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List endangered on the U.S. Federal List, and is on Appendix 1 on sites. This threatened status is primarily due to human hunting and activities. And dugongs are inadvertently trapped and fish in shark nets and die due to lack of oxygen, and they also get struck by boats and ships. Additionally, pollution into the oceans from surrounding land gill seagrass beds and may also negatively influence dugongs directly. Dugongs are also hunted for their meat, oil, and other valuable commodities as previously mentioned. And here are some photographs or illustration of the species dugong dugon. That's all and thank you for listening.